Let's talk about installing a database onto our GKE cluster. So I have my GKE cluster here and I want to install a database onto it. So let's see if we can install MariaDB onto this cluster. Now, if I was going to install MariaDB on a Linux machine, I would use a package manager to do that. All right? So notice here, this is for installing MariaDB on Debian Linux. And then the command, the package manager we would use in that case is apt. And so we'd say sudo apt update, and then we'd say sudo apt install MariaDB server, and that would install our server for us. So we wanna do something similar, but on our Kubernetes cluster. So we need a different package manager. The package manager for Kubernetes is a program called Helm. So notice here I'm at the website helm.sh. And in Helm, there's this concept of charts. A chart is a pre-configured package for installing a Kubernetes application. So I'm gonna do a search here for MariaDB, and I'm gonna pick this first one that comes up. So this one was done by Bitnami. And that brings me to an info page here. And then if I click on the install button, That'll give me the commands I need to run on my cluster in order to install my database onto it. So let's go back to the cluster here and we're going to connect to it. And we'll do that from Cloud Shell. And now we want to run those two commands. So let's go back to this page and we'll copy the first one. And then we'll copy the second one. And hopefully that will install our database. Okay, to see if our database is ready, we can type kubectl get pods. And then when it says one of one is running, then we should be ready to go. Now, when we ran the Helm installation, it gave us some output here telling us how to connect to our backend database. So here it's telling us how we can get our password. So if we grab this command right here, so, so the command is kubectl get secret. So I'm gonna copy that command to the clipboard and then I'm gonna come down here and I'm gonna type echo and then paste. And then that gives me here the auto-generated password for my database. And then up here, it's giving me another command. If you run this, this will create another pod that has a MariaDB client installed on it. And from there, you can test out your database. So let's run that real quick. So now I'm running that other client, and then up here it told me to connect your MariaDB database, you can run this command, and it'll prompt you for your password. And remember, we outputted our password, and it's right here. So let's paste that in. And now we're connected to our database. Show databases. And there's our database here. Okay, in this demo, we showed you how simple it is to install a database on a GKE cluster in Google Cloud. I'm Doug Renstrom with ROI Training.